If you guys are looking for a cheap and reliable place to get your FIFA Ultimate Team coins, check the link in the description and use the code ETANI to get 5% off. Alright guys, so we are back with a brand new video. Today we are trying out Batuai and I have to say, he does look pretty good. And I'm not sure if he's going to be overpowered for his rating. 83 rate, but he does have some pretty standout stats. 82 pace is, I would say, pretty good for this game. It's not that bad. We have played with Giroud yesterday and he was pretty sick. He was really, really good for what he can do and for what kind of player he is. That striker, Giroud, is so good. I definitely try, uh, I definitely recommend checking out that video if you have yet to do so. Um, just a player that, if he fits your playstyle, he's so deadly in the game. 82 pace, 86 shooting, 81 dribbling and 78 physical has some pretty good all-round stats. Now, before we head into the in-game stats, I just want to say we are trying out the same exact squad as yesterday because it played so well, so I want to test it out yet again. Uh, make sure you check out G2A, links will be in the description if you look to buy PSN cards, Microsoft points or cheap PC games. Let's head into the attributes of Batuai and see how he, um, if he has anything standout stats or anything like that. So, 79 acceleration, a bit on the slow side, it will take him a while to get to what? 83 sprint speed, which is quite slow, but that's why we put the Hawk chemistry style on him. 89 attack positioning, 89 finishing is quite high. 89 shot power, 81 long shots is... I mean, with Giroud yesterday, it said that he had low long shots, I think somewhere in the 70s, but his shooting felt incredible. 79 volleys, 72 penalties, vision on the low side, free kicks on the low side, uh, passing is okay-ish for a striker, um, curve is very low, agility is pretty good, balance is really good, reaction is pretty good, ball control, average I would say, dribbling is average as well, composure, very important, 85, 81 heading accuracy, strength though is actually surprising to me, I didn't expect him to be that strong, and 85 jumping, stamina is so low, it's so bad, 68 is, I think this guy could be useless in the second half. Maybe even the start of the second half, who knows? 68 stamina, I've never played with a striker that has that kind of stamina. So it's going to be interesting to see how um, tight he gets in the second half. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. Let's see how... Uh, <coughs> Let's see how he plays out. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Here we go. Alright, so first team we are playing is... What the hell is this team? I'm surprised it wasn't like a bronze zebra or anything like that, like yesterday. I don't know how we faced a guy against with a bronze zebra. But it looks like this guy is maybe making a sub or something as for his striker. I don't know. No, it's not. He's just gonna play. The finesse shot. Oh my days. Okay. Hopefully this guy rage quits straight away. Finesse shot. I don't. Who was his keeper? I need to double check that. But that was an insane finesse shot. That was a great goal, oh my god. You guys see what I did with Deli Ali there? We were able to hold the ball really well with him, and Deli Ali has been doing su such great, like he's been doing such great um, moves for me from yesterday and today. I'm gonna have to buy him. I've had, to, I've been trying him out on loan, but I think he is the best center attacker mid to use in the Premier League. Oh my god. What, what are these finesse shots? This guy is leaving. I mean, I don't blame him. 20 minutes in, 3 nil down. But come on, what are these finesse shots? He's meant to have not the, the best of long shots. He's, he doesn't even have that great shot power, but these finesse shots are crazy. What, um, what goalkeeper does this guy have? Like I said, I don't blame him for leaving, but what goalkeeper? He has Joe Hart. On full chem as well, so I don't know what is going on. I'm not sure if Batchuai's finesse shots are that overpowered or what, but for now, <laughs> they feel like that. Let's head into the next matchup. Don't re not really going to count this. 3-0 in 20 minutes, not really a match. All right, next matchup, boys. I think this is the semis of the Daily Knockout tournament. So, wow, this guy's got um, quite, <laughs> quite a fast uh, attack. That's what I'm telling you, his finesse shots are incredible. Everything seems to go in when you finesse it with him. I mean, the goalkeeper was in a very difficult situation there, but... I don't know. 
Every finesse shot I've taken with him currently is gone in. Him and chasing him. I'm not able to catch up. Ref! How is that not a pen? Just because I shot the ball, how is that not a pen? This game is so stupid sometimes. Well, most of the time, actually. Oh, I saw that coming as well. Good goal. Just let me shoot with Rashford. Oh my god, if Rashford had a better shot, that would have been a 100% goal. I'll take it, though. Great hold up play! What a goal! What is this? He has to be. I don't know. I don't understand. What are these long shots? And any anything that he's doing outside the area, I just cannot understand it. The finesse shots, long shots, the stats are broken. They show you they don't have great stats, but I think everyone just in this game has crazy long shots. Look at that! Come on, you could have the goalkeeper could have easily saved that. How did he just run out like that? Come on. It's like they slow your left back down for the attacker to just run and get the ball. Let's go! My god. He's, he's got a hat trick for us. I would actually use him in my squad, you know. Has to finish that. Everything in the area, outside the area, he's shot has been a goal. I don't his composure is 85. I mean it's 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 high, but I've tried players with higher composure and they miss shots. I don't know. Maybe this guy's got some hidden stats I don't know about. But he seems to be very clinical in the area, very clinical outside the area. This guy is everything. Um he's fast, he's strong. He scored us a header, scored us finesse shots, long shots, everything. Maybe not a free kick. I don't think we could ever score a free kick with him, though. Why are you trying to shoot with umtities? Oh, wait, 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 what? Let's take our time, boys. There we go. Easy as that. 5-2. And this guy, like I said, he scored every single opportunity for us. And especially in those situations, you have to score them. You don't want to be um, with a player or with a striker that you don't feel, you know, confident in finishing. And then you're going to have to sweat it off. But with this guy, I've been just finishing every single opportunity. Maybe I'm not... Referee! Send him off. I don't care. Send him off now. Bring him, bring him, and send him off. There we go. Finally, the referee actually approves of my decision. My god, 80th minute. There's no reason for his guy to get sent off. But you know what? We're going to try the free kick. That's why. 51 free kick accuracy. So we're just going to keep it on goal and hit it. Oh, that was trash. That was a good goal. Very good goal, but I've stopped caring if you guys know what I mean. It's like 5-2, so I wasn't really defending as I wanted. And this guy's pausing the game. 5-3 down, I don't know what he's doing. Look at this, boys. Just gonna trick him, because I know he's gonna slide. Still finishes everything! Still finishes everything! He did get a very lucky save in, but we still managed to finish the rebound. Oh, maybe he's, he could score another one here, boys. Let's bully this. Oh my god! Send him off! I don't care, referee! Send him off! Two guys gone, boys. 87. This guy's not gonna have a team. He's not gonna have a team to play next game. Okay, we're gonna try it again, boys. I don't care. I don't care. Here we go. Put full on power. Where's it gonna go? Ooh, that was actually quite close. If that was on target. Potentially could have gone in, but it's really hard to work with someone that has such low free kick accuracy. So there you guys have it. We completely annihilate this opponent. He was catching up to begin with, but then he became so dirty, gets two players sent off. But at that at that point, I think he had he had a 
it was futile basically. So let's get into the next match. Ten. Six goals. What? He scored every goal for us. All right, four assists for Rashford. You know what would be interesting to see how many assists Rashford has on the squad screen. This guy has been assisting everyone. So Rashford's got 26 games played, six goals and 32 assists. <laughs> and look at this, two goals, nine, I mean two games, nine goals. That is insane. So let's put fitness. All right, let's see what kind of team, what? Attribute, get out of here. Why are you allowed to use attribute cards? This guy is very desperate to get into the weekend league, it seems like. Wow, attribute cards, come on. You know what's funny? It makes me try even harder to beat players that have attribute cards. Like, I would take it easy on this guy, but since... Oh, what a save. Since he has attribute cards, I won't be taking it easy. I, I'm, I'm more um, motivated to beat him. Let's go Rashford, has to finish this. Am I confident he will finish this? Probably not, so we'll just do that. Sweat it out to Batshuayi, get him his seventh goal. Oh my god, Rashford has just been insane for me this game. And he just took a crazy touch towards the end. And that makes us miss an opportunity. That's one of the things I hate about Rashford. Don't let him shoot, don't let him shoot. Oh, he's offside, thank God for that. Really nicely worked goal, but thank God one of his plays was offside. We got very lucky there. <laughs> Nathaniel Klein cannot bully him off, let's go. And, oh, Raf! Oh, we still have it somehow. No, come on. So unlucky, we should have put a lot more power on that. But th these players have attribute cards and we were able to bully them off, which is pretty sick. Finesse shot! Oh, hits the post! I think that's the first finesse shot we missed with him. Come on, I was able to tackle him like eight times. Ref! I mean, what do I mean by ref? <laughs> he didn't do anything wrong. We're just um, getting so unlucky with the bounces. If he scores, definitely does not deserve to score. That was so predictable from him. Let's, let's go, Rashford. Let's go, Rashford. Rashford! Come on, please finish, Rashford. Those normally go in, but you know what? I'm going to have to take Rashford off. Drop in um, Mane, player of the month. And hope for better goals, maybe. You know what? Let's put... On the on the right side, see what we could do in that situation now. Maybe take more long shots with him, try and open up space, maybe get Mane to cross it in, who knows, let's see what we could do. Let's go! That's what you get for switching sides with him. Crazy long shots, everything outside the area is crazy. There we go. Insane play, you know. I really like him. I really, really like him. I think he's he fits one in those categories where he's a strong and decently paced player. Put someone fast alongside him. Mane, very effective as soon as you bring him on. That's why on the right side, find space straight away. With great dribbling, and we're able to. Man we were just able to squeeze in a two 0 lead here. This guy has got attribute cards everywhere. I'm trying my best, and it's like really hard to stop his plays. Speed boost. Try and trick this guy. Trick him again. Ref! What? How could that not be a pen? Anyway, we managed to win the final of the Daily Knockout Tournament. Um, look at that. We only get 2k for that. Come on, that was such a hassle. Anyway, we are back in the weekend league. Um, now, all I want to say about this Betuai is he is so good for his price. He's under 100k and what he can do for your team, he's so effective. And at the same time, like he's scoring us long shots, finesse shots, and at outside the penalty area, he's so effective. I didn't expect that with those kind of stats for him. And basically, use a very fast striker alongside him. Both, that kind of striker combination can be very deadly. So he's fast, he's decently paced, I would say, not fast but very strong at the same time. He's an aerial threat, he scored us one goal with his head, and at the same time, 
He makes really good runs, very clinical in the area, and that's what I loved about him. He's finishing everything, most of the things that you, most of the opportunities you gave, I gave to him, he was able to finish. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I definitely recommend him. He feels like one of the, another option to use in your Premier League team. That's what I love about the Premier League in the, uh, in the CS FIFA is that there's so much, there's just so much choice you could use in your squad, midfield, defenders, uh, forwards. I really like that about the Premier League, and I think it's been very, uh, I think it's been the best league to use um, as a squad for two years now. So hopefully you enjoyed it. Hit the like button if you did, boys, and uh, hopefully you have a very nice day.